The royal newlyweds literally stopped traffic last night in London as the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, of course, you may know them better as Wills and Kate. They made their first official appearance as a married couple. CBS News correspondent Charlie Daggett is in London this morning with the details. Good morning. Good morning to you, Erica. Six weeks to the day since the wedding, if you can believe it. They're back in the limelight and apparently loving it. Uh, papers have been gushing about their appearance, particularly Kate. One called her the Duchess of Dazzle. The newly titled Duchess of Cambridge sparkled on her first official day on the job. Kate and Prince William broke their honeymoon hibernation to be the guests of honor at a black tie dinner for a children's charity. 900 of the very rich, if not so famous, forked over $16,000 a plate for the privilege. Organizers of the event at Kensington Palace say the bash raised $30 million for disadvantaged young people. I know that I am very fortunate. I've had a good education, a secure home, and a loving and supportive family. So many young people, however, do not have these advantages. It's the royal couple's first official public engagement since their wedding five weeks ago. Their meet and greet with President Obama and the First Lady at Buckingham Palace last month was more a matter of politeness than protocol. The newlyweds have been keeping a low profile, returning to a small farmhouse near the military base where Williams serves as a Royal Air Force helicopter pilot. They did find time to pick out a little London love nest, an apartment in Kensington Palace. William lived there as a child, and his mother Diana lived there until her death in 1997. Although the royal couple won't be on display much this summer, Kate's wedding gown will be. It'll be center stage when Buckingham Palace opens its doors to the public in July. Last night's dinner kicked off the start of days of festivities. Prince Philip's 90th birthday today, the official birthday for the Queen tomorrow, and Prince William takes on his brother, Prince Harry, in a polo match on Sunday. Now, they're also planning their first official state visit to Canada next month, and they're going to swing down to California for a few days. Kate has never been to the United States, and she is said to be beyond excited about it. Erica? A lot of people here excited for her arrival as well. Charlie Daggett in London this morning. Charlie, thanks.